My like go-to move is like, you know when you're on a date, you're meant to laugh with your boobs. Laugh with your boobs? Yeah, it's a thing. Is it? How do you laugh with yeah, your boobs? It's a thing. Yeah. So basically you have to be like, ha ha ha. Oh yeah, it is a thing, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is that literally just to get them to go eat? Yeah, basically. And it's like, you know, like, ha <laughs> that's the agents keep in touch. The agents have said to me to have like <laughs> Have, they like, have more fun. Apparently, I'm quite fucking boring on dates or something, but... You come across quite dry, if I'm honest with you. Yeah? Dry? Is she having a laugh? Is this shellfish? I'm getting... I'm... I shouldn't be eating this. Okay. I'm allergic to this. What is he doing? Are you taking the pen? <clears throat> How is everything? Is everything all right? Yeah. Do I crumb? Oh, God, he's got the waiter involved now, too. <coughs> yeah, cos if you ain't got the EpiPen, a sip of water should do it. I don't like this. I don't like when people die I'm on joking, this. I'm joking, I'm not really. How many people have you slept with? Mm. She don't muck about. I've been about, I guess. The words every girl wants to hear on a first date. So give me an estimate. Give me, like, between, like... I have a guess, but I'll, I'll buy her. I think between, like, 30 and 40. Is that right? Bang on. Oh, boom. Yep, bang on. Give or take back 30 or 40. I'm, I feel like it's rude to ask a girl how many people you've slept with. Is it? How many people you slept with? <laughs> I've literally slept with four people. Four people, yeah? That's good. I think that's what people have so wrong about me. They look at me and think, oh my God, like she must be like a slut or like whatever. But I am, I swear to God, I'm like truly the complete opposite. Complete opposite, yeah. I'm just dead not like that. I'm like all for like chicks before dicks type of person. I swear to God. I hear you, sister. What do you look for in a woman? Like what, what features do you like? I love fake boobs. And talking crap has resumed. Oh. Like love, shape, symmetry, the lot. Symmetry. Just the really? way they sit, yeah, yeah. Just the way they sit. Just like a big fan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, um. Did he just get away with saying that? Symmetry? Yeah. You're in luck, cos oh. I got them for sure. Well, there we go. Any of your ex girlfriends have fake boobs? No. Itty bitty titty committee. Oh. <laughs> so I think I feel really exposed. Oh, this looks good. Amy's back with Aislin. I've got good chat lines. I'm all for good chat up line. Come on, son, make Loza proud. My casual yeah. one is like, I'll get my phone out, get my new car. I've lost my number. Can I have yours? No, I'll do, can you fill out this questionnaire for me and then bring it up on the, like, the new contact screen? <laughs> so it's got name, last name, number. What are yours? What about, are you from Tennessee? Tennessee. This is like watching a sexy catchphrase. Have you heard there's only eight planets left? No. That's because NASA has announced that I destroyed Uranus. Oh, Ace, you filthy bastard. I'm Eyal. I'm Kezia. What's this, the exotic name club? Right. So, I have looked at some of your feedback yeah. from your dates. They all agree that you're a very attractive guy. Also, Nearly all of them agree that your banter needs a little bit of help. Oh, feel the burn. Can you imagine that I am Kylie's right now? OK, what are you um, going to ask from me? You're clearly attracted to her, so how are you going to flirt with her? Show me. She's got nice, cool hair, so I might <laughs> talk about hair, maybe. Touch yeah. her hair. Go on, show me. Do you well, go like this? Different hair. <laughs> well, it depends. She's got curly hair, so I might touch it and, like, I don't know, say, wow, you've got nice hair. Mm. Yeah, did you like that? Not really. <laughs> um, OK, so I won't touch her hair. When it gets to seduction time... Yeah. Just be a little bit more... Strokey. Yeah, and, and you touch her hair like this, OK? okay. Yeah. Think unsexy thoughts here, Al. Theresa May. Theresa May. Good. I like you're coming on you to know me what? now. I think, I think maybe you need to try it on <laughs> a girl that... Strips so like that. Mm-hmm. That's better. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then, then move in. Whoa, hang on a minute. Talk to her like this. Imagine if they had kids. The names. Then go for the okay. kiss. Thought you were gonna kiss me there. <laughs> <laughs> well. Got all excited. My back has been killing me. Oh wait, I know this one, because you've had her on your mind all day. Your back? Yeah. Why? I don't know. All day it's just been aching. 
Do you want to give me a back massage? All oh, right, it's just actually got a sore back. Where yeah, about here? Just yeah, no, just a, there. around the salt shoulders. It's great. How's he pulled this off? Is that too no. hard? No, that's actually really good. Very natural. He's not some sort of silky anti monkey love god. Oh yeah, you just sip on your wine. Why give me a massage? It's the life, isn't it? Just a bill, please. Thank you. I've got to be straight with you. And um, oh, I never know what you're going to come out with. At the mixer, yeah. I had a few too many Prosecco's. Right. Right. Is this another one of his chat up lines? And I've lost my bank card. Right. So, I can't pay for this milk. Oh, he's not kidding. OK. But if you pay for this one... Yeah. And if you want to go on a second date, I'll pay for the next one. Bloody hell, he spun that one. You don't want to do I it right. Don't, I don't you have don't... much choice. It's still a second date, though. Thank you. So, so, I, I can I? Yeah, sure. <laughs> this is lovely. Look at this whole Do you like ensemble it? you got here. This is art as well. Eh? Well, it's ravishing. <laughs> Do you go to galleries and exhibits often? Yes, uh, more in Italy than here. I usually go with my mom. Typically, people our age aren't able to understand the depth of art. Um, Alec, a blind man taught you to paint. I think we understand what an absolute mess looks like. But perhaps I go with you. Because, because we are on the same level. Something tells me that if I went to an exhibit with you, I wouldn't have to try and force any opinion or any perspective on you. Sorry, didn't you do that about half an hour ago, mate? I mean, if Isidore was any more on my wavelength, she'd actually be me. I'm having a really good time. Me too. Fuck, this is unexpected. I mean, I got a massive problem here, like huge. Until now, Charlotte was absolutely perfect. But along comes Isidore, and now I couldn't be more confused. Yeah, terrible problem, mate. Well, let me tell you, I desperately, desperately want to kiss you, but I'm going to not try to do anything because I'd like to potentially see what you're all about. Bloody hell, it must be love. He don't normally give any warning. <laughs> Is that... I've had a really wonderful time with you. I feel the same. Good. I have absolutely no idea how you did that, but well done, bruv. Can we get the bill, please? Before I fuck this up, that'd be great. Thank you very much.